So I re-listened um, to yesterday's set song actually as I was falling asleep, which might be against the rules, but I did it anyway. Um, and it actually didn't. It was, it was weird because when I heard it live in person, I it sounded like I asked the question about black and white twice. And I was re-listening to it, and it no longer sounded as black and white. Um, what you're saying, and kind of the observation of that is that what, what it felt like you were talking about um, was like maybe not pointed on your part, but like hitting something directly in the ego or whatever. So then it reacts in, in a in a, in a in a manner that makes it seem like it's all or nothing basically and not a fluid kind of I don't know I, I felt like that this is just kind of my theory of it is like it feels like I was hearing it black and white because it was hitting something that didn't want to hear it necessarily mm -hmm. Letting go of notions and concepts, ideas, is a difficult thing for the ego. But even belief is an idea. And so the mind, the ego has many, many different uh, self-defense mechanisms, if you will. And so practicing deep listening, anytime you're going to listen, be aware of the breath while you're listening and listen intently, listen deeply. The only way you can truly listen deeply is if you've let go of the judgments. And so that is a, a practice. <laughs> that uh, is, um, is uh, so important. If I'm going to listen to you, to really hear you, maybe you don't even know what you're asking, what you're saying, what you mean and what you're saying. But if I'm going to really hear you, I have to I have to listen deeply, not with the self, that has the judgments, that carries the judgments. If I come in, in with any preconceived notions or concepts of you, I won't be able to truly hear you. I will hear that my ears will only hear through the filter of past judgment. I'll see you, but I won't really see you. It's like when so many came to see Christ to see Jesus and yet in seeing him they didn't really see him hearing they didn't really hear having eyes they did not see and ears they did not hear Listening deeply is a practice we must learn. And really, it all begins again with you being present. What does this mean? You will never listen deeply to another as long as you believe that you are an independent self. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. Give us a thumbs up, comment, thoughts, questions in the section below. Let us know what you want to hear from us. Subscribe to our channel for more life-changing content. And as always, check the section below for our website, for live events, where we'll be, what we're up to, more about us, and our online school website is listed below as well. We love you. We're glad you're here. We want to hear from you. We're in this with you.